Alright, so pretty much sorry for the fast motion on that. Um try and get to pace on this off figure. So pretty much what this figure is. It's a nice cool 15 inch figure, obviously you've probably seen it. And um you know. So pretty much what like the reason why I haven't turned it on uh sound and everything is because it needs batteries. So I had a bunch of these. Yeah. Those cool figures, the team figures. Um, I had a shirt. Um, well, pretty much had almost all the Chucky lines, except for the Charles B2 and all. And um, you know, Charles B2 one. It's it's like almost like a recap of three. And um. Uh, I guess they made a part one of the nice cool version, but this is the Jim Carrey Pennywise. Um, you know, as a favorite Pennywise, I wouldn't say I have a favorite, or which, you know, honestly, the first one of this movie, because they made two chapters. One is the first movie, chapter two is the second movie, which is like 27 years old. later. I don't know. I can't, I can't really like the second movie. It's because, I don't know, the first one was kind of boring, not gonna lie, I tried watching it, um, I, I did get through it, it's, you know, it's a good movie for what it is, and, um, the second one, I went straight to sleep trying to watch it, <laughs> kid you not, um, this, at the time when this was made, I think it was, like, made, like, months after the first one, I'm not sure, but, um, this was when they made in 1990s, and I was born in 2000, early 2000s, like 01. I was born in 01, so pretty much I knew this clown was around. I just never got tend to watching it as a young kid. I did watch a lot of horror, just not this typically person. Um, until like 2016, I think when there's rumored of a new it Pennywise coming in to theaters or coming back. And then uh, it was more scary than this one. I tend to watch that one in movie theaters. Watch the first one and the second one, which I did not really like the second one better than the first one. Once again, it's always something about that second one. They need to rewrite <laughs> on making these reboots our originals on another It movie. If we get a reboot again, which I doubt as of now, because I think I heard there's a chapter three or a re uh, uh, what you call it. What, should, what, what do you call that when a movie Ray made a storyline and they, they want to go back in back in time to redo the story or, or re retract the story from the beginning? Oh, prequel, pre, prequel. That's what it is. They're making a prequel of the um, the 2017 Pennywise. So pretty much, you know, Jim Carrey is a good Pennywise. It just wasn't, you know, that scary for me. So pretty much, we're gonna do is open the batteries up. Or open this shit up, put some new batteries. Cause right now I want to hear what this thing is capable of saying. So you can see the battery chips right here is kind of weird looking at it. Um, but yeah, let's get a screwdriver and I'll unscrew this real quick. So yeah, we're back on. Um, pretty much we're gonna unscrew this. Hopefully it's right. Yeah, it's right. Um, hopefully I got the right batteries for this. Um, I'm gonna check it out. What type of batteries it needs? It feels empty like there was no batteries here. But if that's the case, you know, it's not there and then fuck. Let's put new batteries. Um, so yeah. These are the batteries. I'm gonna take them out one by one. Um, let's check it. I'm gonna take out in the back one by one. These are dead batteries. Let's pop this guy out. So yeah, these are the batteries you need. I'ma check if I have them. I'll be back with um, hopefully replacing batteries. All right, so we're back, and we have to put some light on this. Um, so pretty much, do that to all these batteries. Um, so yeah, we came back with, you know, able to find some batteries. Unfortunately, I did not find them at the, at my house, my crib. Literally you had to go to the dollar store and get them right there and then. But hey, it's better than you know. Trying to get this last one. It's better than waiting a whole day, right? 
it is dark out though. So I can tell you that. So yeah, so pretty much the batteries is right here. And let me get them up this bag. But yeah, um you know now nowadays you know what they said, dollar ain't shit today in America. Um so I paid instead of a dollar I paid like twenty cents more, which they ain't nothing, I guess. Back in the days. You know, just a dollar straight or maybe a dollar fit not fifty or a dollar and five cents. But now since you live in America, you know everything is going up everything because that dollar is not worth that much anymore thanks to all this you know chaos but anyways let's just get to the video here let me um get the battery all set all right so we got the new batteries in um let's see of course they fit because why would I buy something that wouldn't fit uh, one extra one right here. I wish I had like two more extra ones so just in case some of my other figures batteries die. Got it right there. So right now I think it's off or oh, this battery isn't hitting right. Let's see, I'm gonna put this back away real quick. Yeah, fuck it. So pretty much I gotta boost that in. Alright, so pretty much I got the figure that actually work now. Um has batteries and I switch from Pennywise the dancing cow. So those are the two phrases he has if he's on primary mode. Strike it down or up to um, different mode. So pretty much, um, those are like a couple phrases, I guess they're famous in the first one, hopefully there's no second one in here, could be, I'm not sure, I forgot about the second one, like I said, it was kind of boring for me, but Jim Carrey did a cool performance as um, Pennywise, then we had the remake, Billy, I forgot his last name, but, um, he, he's good too. Um, honestly, man, if I was to get one of these, um, to get this autograph or a penny with autograph, I would really not want to choose Jim Carrey. Jim Curry, my bad, I said Jim Carrey. But Curry, because, um, <clears throat> yeah, he's iconic as fuck. He was from Home Alone. He's, I think, no, nah, no, nah, I was going to say Grinch, but I doubt it. And he's from other places too. But at the same time, you know. The signature really is really really small compared to like <clears throat> other signatures I had in the past and they're kind of better quality well I mean not better quality but bigger enough to see but I'm saying um I understand Jim Curry um had a stroke and all that and he has never been the same since 2012 but um you know it sucks to see him like 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 back then then no then like you know in the wheelchair then he was back then as it pennywise the, like one of the best icons he was like a devil figure forgot what, what movie from but um but yeah um the reason why i wouldn't want jim curry signature is because i know it costs a lot same thing with michael j fox i, I guess because celebrities they be having problems you know health problems if they have health problems and stuff and it's kind of hard for them to attend conventions they are going to charge a lot which sucks you know people are looking look up to them 
today people look up to Jim Curry, Michael J. Fox, and other celebrities that have health problems. And most of them charge a lot. Like, they charge, like, fucking a fortune. Like, bro, they charge more, like, half a PS5 with her signature. If it was retailed, not even resale, retailed. Good thing it was not, you know, not resale. But, but yeah, I think this guy charged, like, 250 or 300 to get him to get signed. And, um, if you think about it, the most I would pay, uh, most I would pay for signature is like tops two fifty to two hundred dollars, and that's it. Nothing over. It was like three to like four or five. I'm straight. Keep keep your writing. You know, save that ink and like for you know, just save that ink. You know, I don't want to pay three hundred for ink on my you know items. But um, like I said, man. It sucks, but you know I am looking forward to getting a 2017, 19 Pennywise, and you know, you know, um, not not a mascot one, but a Neko one, um, because you know they tend to have better, better um quality and more details with articulation and stuff. And you know I'm a huge NECA fan. Mezco, I think this is the only Mezco figure I have now. I have had more in the past, but like I said, I sold them. But um, I'm keeping this as Mezco because NECA, I don't know, NECA ain't really doing that much. You know, horror figures as 18 inch, not all of them. Only the like the ones that are big now, the ones that like ready come out. Um, cause I do want an Ash uh, from Evil Dead figure 18 inch from Mecca but like bottom McFarlane one instead same thing with um what you call it on Letterface and um Scream had alternatives for that one one McFarlane and the other one's like Spencer's old ass Spencer's um you know figure like I said I'm collecting some of these old or vintage Spencer's uh, sold items any ones too not all of them but um you know this one's definitely in the book. Like I said, Jim Curry is an icon. Just signature is not my type of memo to get right. Especially if it's small. Not getting a small signature that you know I gotta zoom in or show somebody up close to see like you know. Yeah, like I said, I have respect for Jim Curry. He, he's an icon. I did grow up with some of his films. Um but yeah, um if I was to choose a pennywise. I don't say I say both are good and from their own you know differences and their own ways and you know there's no such thing as a better you know anyways but yeah man if y'all like this video please like subscribe hit the like button um hit the notification bell and you know to see more of my videos coming out this Halloween special you know cause this video literally comes out on Halloween and I might do like a couple more horror um, items just for a little bit and you know do a convention because um, I'm over the oh, days of the dead um, this um, well, November shit pretty much um but anyways you know just for last horror um, you know videos for the year I think next year I'm gonna start in the summer because I think I tend to drag you know to make videos hopefully i can start doing horror um, videos in the summer i'll wait till like october mid-november you know and then there and then repeat next year every year but like i said i'll see you all in the next one please like comment subscribe and um hit the notification bell and i'll see you all in the next one